it's 5 a.m. now, and uh, last night we only got about a half as far as we wanted to. We were at the um, refuge day. Do you remember what the refuge name is? <laughs> oh, I can't remember these French names. <laughs> I know, we could never remember French. So that's how we got mixed up yesterday. Anyway, it's 5 a.m. now, so we're going to try to make the remaining 30 miles to Gouvernier this morning. And uh, it's not raining. It was raining pretty heavy last night. So we're a little bit wet, but um, I think uh, positive attitude. I think we're we'll do it. 30 miles today. 30 miles, yeah. Tough train. <laughs> We're making pretty good time, even in the dark, but we have paused our schedule to take pictures of this cool salamander. Yeah, we're, we're, we're making good time. We'll see how that holds up through the rest of the day, because we've heard that there's some pretty rough terrain moving forward, and um, we don't know how slow that's gonna be. So we've been hiking for almost 12 hours now and I think we've only gone like 15 maybe 20 miles if we're lucky we're trying to make the ne next refuge but we've heard it's closed because there was a COVID case so Chad and I are debating whether we're gonna push on to the following refuge which might get us there like 9 or 10 tonight and then it's if we get there like at nine they might serve us some food any later than that it's unlikely that they would we'll see what happens we may end up eating cold soaked freeze dried tonight to rest yeah. and then tomorrow I think I might actually if I can get out at like five in the morning I might actually 
actually be able to do that at my old place. Okay. The only problem is with resupply, my pack will be a few pounds heavier, so that's a bummer. Yeah. I can give you my dehydrated food so you don't need to try to find it out. Yeah, actually, that would help. Last night, uh, Chad was having a lot of trouble. He uh, woke up vomiting. He, he's thrown up about four or five times in the past 12 hours, and um, he's gonna call it quits at Gavarnier because um, he's just feeling too weak. He's not able to keep down fluid. And um, I think we're gonna barely make it to Gavarnier rent a hotel and then um you know he's gonna try to take a bus or hitchhike out and get to barcelona but um i think yesterday was just he kind of pushed it too hard yesterday and um he uh his body was not able to recover Chad and I are in Gavarnier right now. Um, we had to hike, how far was it? 13 miles. 13 miles from, um, what is it? Something, Something to go. Yeah. So I gave Chad the option of descending to a small town about five miles away from where we were at camp last night. And um, he chose to stay with me, so he had to climb 2,000 feet out of that valley to and then descend <laughs> to 9,000 feet oh. and then descend another 4,000 feet. But fortunately, he oh. was having a lot of trouble walking. <laughs> he threw up like 27 times in the past 24 hours. And um, <clears throat> he literally has nothing left in his system. But we made it to Gavarnier, and um, we hitchhiked the past few miles. Um, he couldn't make the full car ride. He had to stop the car. We had to stop the car, and he threw <laughs> up next to the car. So 
it, it was, it's been a tough ride, but Chad is uh, deciding to bail out of this super fun trip. He's been having a great time the past. <laughs> I have been 12. actually, <laughs> just last night went to hell. <laughs> so I'm going to continue on by myself and uh, he's going to go party it up in Barcelona with his friends. And tonight we're going to go have dinner with some trail friends. Yeah. So I think that'll be cool. Oh. This is a video. Say cheese in the video. <laughs> so where are we eating? Uh, I don't know. Just anywhere that seems nice, I guess. Sounds good. Are you uh, texting to tell someone about the pizza? Actually, I love my sister. <laughs> She's telling me, like, hope everything's going well. Okay. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, shit. I think it's a video. <laughs> <laughs> well, I shoot a lot of videos, but, um... Yep. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's awesome.